Hello, my name is Jaden Jones. I'm here to tell you more about Cicely Tyson today. She was born in December of 1924, even though some of those reports are not very accurate. Some people believe that she was actually born in 1933. Yeah, she was from New York. But, uh, she got into the theater in 1983. But before then, she was uh, just being an actress, um, playing in certain roles in certain movies. Um, how theater was before she got there, it was a, a lot more white people. Black people were starting to get into it, but they weren't too much into it. She, she, was, start, she was one of the first up-and-coming black female people to be on, female women to, fem, to be on Broadway. Um, some things she played in when she opened in 1983, she had played in Corn, Corn and Green. That was her opening uh, play. She has played in Roots, The Help. Roots, she played a um, runaway. She was a runaway, not a runaway slave. She was a slave helping other slaves to run away in the Roots. In The Help, she was a housemaid. That was just being helpful throughout the movie, helping with certain things. And um, she has also shown, like, things she does outside of theater when she's not acting. She shows a lot of commitment to her community. to Because um, after Dr. King got assassinated, she took it upon herself to build a dance studio in Harlem where she actually teaches on the side sometimes. Um, let's see, um, she, um, yeah, she played in a lot of things. Um, well, she played in Jane, it's this old, old movie, like, that my grandma was telling me about that she played in. Um, she, all she had trouble finding roles earlier on because she wouldn't just do roles for the money. She was, if she did a role, she really wanted to believe that the role was actually something that was going to help her be possible. She wasn't just doing any dummy role that she probably wouldn't benefit or learn much from outside of money, something like in that, in that area. Some awards she has won was, a. Uh, she was, uh, in 1977, she was inducted into the Black Filmmakers Hall of Fame. And that's a pretty big award, especially because she was like one of the first black actresses to be in that uh, discussion for that award that she won. She also won the 95th Spring, Spring uh, Garns Medal. Um... It's a big award because that's kind of that's like a lifetime achievement award. So you just do a lot. Like that's an award you earn from hard work and dedication and working throughout like very hard. Um, if there was an actor today that reminds me a lot of her, I wouldn't say necessarily remind, but like just her work ethic and stuff, it would be Lupita Nyong'o because she too has had to overcome a lot. And, um, not even racism necessarily, but just they, her being darker is just more difficult for her to get films and not being as attractive as some women who get lead roles is something that they have to overcome and they have done well at. But I'm Jalen Johnson and I would like to thank you.